Who was the 49ers best yak guy? Is this a question? Yes. It's by I think far it's a Samuel. I think it's by, by far. far. You wouldn't even put Kittle in the conversation. I think here's where I think Debo separates himself. From okay. Him. I okay. think they're equally powerful runners and equally aggressive runners in terms of seeking contact and absorbing contact and breaking tackles. Yes. I think Samuel is more explosive in terms of being able to change direction. And I think Samuel has a little more make you miss than Kittle does. And obviously yeah. that also goes to the fact that Samuel's smaller. But I yeah. think – and then I think Samuel's first step explosion – like, I think Debo Samuel is one of the more underrated, freaky, freaky athletes in the NFL. Like, 230-pound men, 220-pound men aren't supposed to have that freaky first-step explosion that he has. Once he gets going, he hits gears that he's not supposed to hit at his that size. That is true. And I don't think Kittle has that, you know, breakaway, just gone lightning gear. I think Samuel yeah. has it. And so, to me, it is Debo Samuel. Uh, I think Kittle is physical. I think Kittle is phenomenal after the catch. But I just think Debo has a little more make you miss and a little more explosiveness and a little more juice. So I would 100% go Debo. I would 100% go Debo as well. It's just you saying not even close uh, was interesting because I would consider Debo and Kittle to be two of the five best guys after the catch in the league. Um, yeah. So, I'm, so I, mean, I mean, Kittle's up there. But Debo's better. I mean, he's faster. He's more elusive. He's just as punishing. Um, he seems to pack just as much of a punch, 30 pounds lighter or 20 pounds lighter. Yeah, I agree with that. Yeah. I agree too. I mean, they're all good. But he's unbelievable. Yeah, he's the best are. I've ever seen. He's the best I've ever seen. After, after the, the catch. catch. I mean, I look, Jerry Rice was, was the best of all time. Um, he did it differently. Jerry Rice's prime was in the 80s before my time. By the time I, I was aware of Jerry Rice, he was already 30. So let me take that back. But uh, Debo does it his own way. I, I used to compare him to Percy Harvin. He's way better than Percy Harvin. You think he's way better? Because I think they're different. Get Percy didn't run through people like that. Yeah, but Percy had a season where seven games into the year he was the he MVP. Was the MVP. Of football. He was he was, and maybe that'll be Debo this year. Could be. Could, could be. We'll see.